Anambra State Governor Charles Soludu has appealed to tricycle riders and commercial taxi drivers to cooperate with his administration for the good of the state. This comes following the protests by tricycle riders and commercial taxi drivers over the newly introduced taxes by the state government. Commissioner for Transportation Patricia Ikwebuki, who represented the governor, made the appeal while addressing journalists on the development at the state government house, Oka. The commissioner assured the protesters that their taxes and those of other business operating in the state will be used to secure and develop the state. Anambra State Government had, after a consultative meeting with market leaders and commercial tricycle operators on the 29th of June 2022, approved a new tax rate for transport sectors in the state, which increased the monthly tax for motorcycle operators to 15,000 naira and 25,000 naira for taxi drivers. They understand that on a daily basis they pay more. They understand that this is change, but they are resisting it. And we have been transparent with them. We have consistently engaged them. The average Kake person in Anambra State pays close to 2,000 Naira on a daily basis. And you pass it by 30 days. You know what that comes into. Government is doing this, number one, to ensure that we create a livable and prosperous homeland. So livable on one side, it ensures ensuring that the uh, issues around touting, around harassment and intimidations, uh, intimidation rather, is, you know, handled. Now, uh, prosperous in the sense that we start to generate the kind of revenue that would make Anambra State viable. As we've seen this past few days, I want to attribute because of enough lack of information. And that we have a responsibility to do. Moving forward, we will now continue to shred this information, break it down, so that our people will understand it. There's no increment whatsoever, that's for sure. The fees remains the same. So whatever information that you've had is false. 